to define here the density matrix. So having the uh, wave function, so if, uh, here we have the wave function, we define the first order density matrix in this way. This is the density matrix which depends on R sigma and R prime and sigma prime. So it has n is the number of electrons. Here we have the summation of the spin variables from sigma 2 to sigma n. We have the interval ratio and the spatial uh, coordinates from uh, R2 and Rn. And therefore, like the free uh, variables that they are not integrated or not summed, are R sigma here and then R prime and sigma prime here. So th that's the density matrix. So it's like making the um, scalar product of uh, psi and, and, uh, and psi. But here in this scalar product, we are not doing the integration over the uh, R1 and you are not considering the summation on sigma 1. Okay, once we have defined this density matrix, we can see that there are two magnitudes which are actually related with the density matrix. One is the spin density. The spin density is related with the diagonal elements of this density matrix. Uh, diagonal elements are those where r prime and sigma prime are r and sigma. So this, these are diagonal elements of the density matrix. And this diagonal element of density matrix is the spin density matrix. So the electrons uh, the density of electrons with uh, with uh, uh, spin state sigma. Okay, this is one. And on the other hand, we can see that the kinetic energy can also be extracted from the spin summed or also called the uh, reduced density matrix. So first, let's define which is the reduced density matrix. So this is the uh, density matrix. And if we sum over sigma and sigma prime, we are getting the what's called the reduced density matrix. Okay, and it's uh, quite straightforward to see that the kinetic energy can be obtained in this way from this reduced density matrix. So it's minus one over two, the integral over the R, the whole uh, volume, the Laplacian of the reduced density matrix, and it's calculated in the R uh, equal R prime. So here we have analyzed a new uh, magnitude, which is actually related with the density, uh, with the electronic density, but in a more, let's say, complex way. We have defined here the density matrix.